It took a gun, a painter's stir stick, and an alert neighbor to scare away a man on the attack with a knife this afternoon. And tonight, one of the men he stabbed is sharing his frightening story. KXLY 4's Annie Bishop is live at the county jail where the suspect is in lockup tonight, Annie. Well, certainly 26-year-old Justin Worley is now charged with burglary and assault. The homeowner involved here said he had never met Worley before, and now he'll never forget his face. Pretty, I was freaking out pretty good. While at home with his five-week-old son and five-year-old daughter, Johnny Gall got a knock on his door. It was a man with a knife looking for his girlfriend's brother. He tried coming into my house, and I gave him a front kick to the stomach, and he fell off my porch. Within seconds of him coming back from that kick he had a knife in his hand and he came at me with that knife and I, I dodged back like this and my friend was like whoa stabbing gall in the foot and his friend Trevor in the hand he wasn't just like trying to poke somebody he it was like a movie man that guy was stabbing anything that came in his path really gall grabbed what he could to get 26 year old Justin Worley to stop I just started hitting him with my kids toy trying to like you know because he started coming at me after he stabbed my friend and he was on the ground I called him out to get him out into the front yard and he came after me Gall then picked up a painting stir stick, but he says Worley didn't flinch. A neighbor heard Gall screaming and showed up with a pistol. That made him right then and there. Instantly, he changed his mind. Right when that pistol came out, boom, he just stopped with everything and just took off. Yeah, he but he didn't get very far. Police arrested Worley a few miles away. Gall and his friend are now thankful for police and their neighbor, who ended the confrontation sooner than later. Thanks for you to come up, man, because who knows on where it would have spiraled from there, you know. And police tell us there was a woman also with Worley during this confrontation. Police believe she was stabbed in the hand as well. Tonight, police still searching for her. Reporting live, Annie Bishop, KXLY4 HD News.